No, I don't think so. I think emotion is what separates human beings from animals. And the ability to show complex emotions and convey those to others is one of our greatest strengths. And regardless if you're a man or a woman, I think it is essential for you to show emotion. Because then, if not, what separates you from some lifeless robot walking the line every day? It's a good question. I often wonder that myself, why emotion is seen as sort of the norm of masculinity or of what is kind of popularly referred to as toxic masculinity. Um, and so I think that restriction of emotion can be really harmful and show up in many ways. Um, but I would imagine that there's a historical connection to traditional gender roles where men are seen as the dominant one or as the caretaker of the, the entire family and so showing emotion can be seen as a form of weakness and weakness is not um, part of the man box or part of this notion of what should be masculine. In this day and world, I feel like it kind of is. I feel like with the way it is portrayed, it's more of a, you have to look a certain way, you have to act a certain way to get that masculinity that's portrayed in movies and TV shows. But there still is like that toxicness of like men needing to be these big, bulky, muscular in order to be considered a man rather than just being a representation of themselves. Feeling the need to be strong all the time and not being able to show others how they're actually feeling. Just like to put up a front to look more powerful and strong. I think it is protection from the dangers of the world around them. Personally, I grew up on the south side of Chicago um, 83rd and Damon, if anyone watching this knows where that is. Uh, and emotion was something that could easily get you robbed, mugged, killed, because people look for weakness and they assume emotion is weakness. And you're taught to not look that way, not care too much, and you just instinctively bottle it up to protect yourself. But in reality, I think if men could learn to sort of fight those teachings, because it's not the world we live in anymore, and I'm not trying to say it's safe everywhere you go, but I think showing emotion could oftentimes be the difference between life and death, be the difference between getting something you want or losing out. And hiding it away just makes you less human.